If this line of C++ code looks fine to you, maybe you're getting too used to using the Microsoft compiler. This compiles perfectly on MSVC, but it shouldn't. And if you're using auto like this, especially with return values, you might be writing code that breaks on other compilers or worse, leads to subtle bugs. Let's look at this code. What is wrong here besides Anakin getting ready to be cooked alive? This compiles fine in MSVC, but return of the string returns a temporary object. We are trying to bind a temporary object to a non-const L-value reference, which is not valid C++. Quang and GCC reject it and they're right. In standard C++, you can only bind temporaries to const reference or R-value reference. Why? Because the temporary dies at the end of the full expression. A non-const L-value reference expects a stable object, not a short-lived one. MSVC, however, has a non-standard extension that allows this. It extends the lifetime of the temporary, something the standard explicitly forbids. This becomes a silent landmine when you're writing cross-platform code. On MSVC, everything compiles, but then your Linux build throws a fit. Or worse, your code breaks when ported. What to do instead? Don't code in C++. Just joking. Don't bind an L-value reference to a temporary object and know how auto works. The auto keyword drops references, const qualifiers and volatile qualifiers, so you need to explicitly add them to the type when needed. In return of the string example, we can solve the issue by using one of the following syntaxes. Just auto, which is the same as std string in that case, or using const auto reference. Auto R value reference can still do, but it is pretty much pointless here. Quick note, using auto ampersand ampersand creates a forwarding reference or also known as universal reference. Such references can bind both to an L value or an R value depending on the assigned type and can be used for perfect forwarding. If you don't know what that is, much to learn you still have. In our case, since the type on the right is a temporary, the variable type becomes an R value reference. So to sum up, the fix is simple. Don't use auto reference with functions that return by value. Use just auto or const auto reference if you want to avoid copies but still respect lifetimes. How to catch this even in MSVC? There is a compiler flag that forbids non-standard extensions. You can directly add it if you're building from the command line or change it in Visual Studio. Right click on your project, go to properties, C++, language and set conformance mode to yes. MSVC gives you more freedom than it should, but that freedom can bite you. Know the rules and write portable, safe C++. Have you seen this happen in your codebase? Drop a comment and share the weirdest compiler book you've hit.